Hey, I'm Nick from Dorman Products. Welcome to our video on VTEC solenoids and gaskets. VTEC is a Honda and Acura specific term for electronically controlled variable valve lift and timing, depending on what vehicle is being discussed. VTEC has had many forms. Some use oil pressure to move sliding pins on the rockers to open additional valves or alter the duration and lift for increased power. Other use oil pressure to alter cam timing by way of phasers, and another deactivate cylinders to save fuel. The long story made short is that there have been many implementations of variable cam lift and timing that Honda has used over the decades, and it's done them all under the general umbrella of VTEC. The common thread through all of these systems is that all of them rely upon engine oil pressure being actuated by the solenoids. Those solenoids rely on clean, pressurized oil. They use an integrated screen and gasket to keep the oil moving to the hard parts within the engine. If the gasket or screen fails, codes and misfires are likely to be in your future, and they may not even be related to the variable valve timing system. Even the tiniest cracks and splits can make a mess of the engine bay and cause drastic performance issues. Worse yet, on most applications, the oil leak will drip directly into the alternator windings, taking out a fairly expensive component. Eagle Eye technicians will check this area thoroughly when one of these vehicles comes into the service bay to solve the problem before the alternator fails. This is an issue that hits close to home. I own a collectible Acura Integra Type R, one of the earliest vehicles in America to be fitted with VTEC. I understand how critical the supporting items are in the system, and I'm proud Dorman makes them to keep these powerful and fuel efficient engines running as they were designed. As you can see here, we sell both the gaskets and the strainers as well as a VTEC solenoid for some applications. The gaskets can be replaced to keep your car running tip top. In the case of this solenoid, you can replace a damaged unit if yours happens to stick, fail electrically, or for peace of mind on a customer's car with particularly dirty oil. The 918056 and the 918056 GS are neat little OE fixes. On some vehicles with a 3.5 liter V6, like the Pilot, Odyssey, and Accord, Honda won't sell you just the gaskets and screens. Instead, they expect you to purchase the whole VTEC solenoid with plate, gasket, and spool valve for a lot more money, even if you just have a simple leak from a gasket, questionable screen, or just a failed solenoid. In fact, the Honda TSB20023 specifically advises Honda technicians to install just the solenoid assembly, plate, gaskets, and hardware, and not install the lower half of the spool valve assembly. They literally just throw them away. Our OE Fix 918056 GS gasket includes just the parts you need to put your solenoid back into service, allowing replacement of just the part that failed, not a more expensive assembly. This can be a great choice for a higher mileage vehicle or a price sensitive customer. Our other OE fix for these vehicles is the 918056. It's the same gasket set with screen plate, hardware, and the solenoid assembly itself, just like a Honda Tech would install. We hope you like these new solutions, and remember, if you need anything at all, the Dorman Technical Support Team is always there to help. Thanks for checking out our video on these VTEC parts to help keep this system operable and leak-free. I'm Nick, and I'll see you next time.